Nielsen in five. Adeleke goes in six. Katsmarek, we saw just now, in seven. Usually judges her races to perfection. She's a strong finisher. Watch her, the pole in seven. Klava in eight. Always goes out really hard in that orange of the Netherlands. And Miklos of Romania in lane nine. Watch second to right, Klava. Will she do the usual blast off? Klava from Kazmarek. Looks like she's gone off quickly too. In the red and white, they're third from right. Adeleke chasing hard, nice and steady with those long Irish legs. And also going well at the moment is Nielsen. She's committed well through the first 150 meters. Kazmarek possibly leading. She's up on Klava, who seems to have judged this one better. Is she saving something for the second half? Look at Adeleke closing up, gradually eating to the gap between herself. And uh, they pull. Katsumarek being passed now by Adeleke. This is the battle for gold down the home straight. The rest of them swimming behind. Klava coming through for third place. But this is the battle. Katsumarek has the years in her legs, the strength and the experience. And she nails it there. But look at the gap behind them. 48.98 for Katsumarek. It's a massive personal best. Exactly half a second than she's ever run before. Katsmarek of Poland makes it gold for her nation. A proud, proud nation who are so, so experienced at 400 meter running and training. A lot of knowledge there. Adelaide, a brilliant silver for Ireland. Threw everything at it. Couldn't quite have the strength on this occasion through the last uh, 50 meters. Fifth two years ago, second today. What will she do in a couple of years' time? And the bronze going to Klava, but a long way back. Brilliant race, sub 49 seconds. Sydney McLaughlin Lebrone has run a 48.75 as a world lead, but Kasparek with a 48.98 becomes only the third woman in the world this year to go under 49 seconds. It was wonderful, absolutely paced to perfection. On the top bend, Rashida Adeleke put the Polish athlete under pressure. It looked like Adelecki was going to go away, but she was rocking and a rolling. And the Polish athlete, who qualified third for this final, had the strength. She knew it was quick. You know if you're shoulder to shoulder with Rashida Adelecki, this is a quick time. 